the Spanish immersion program, K through 12, is really exciting in the sense that at our level, in the kinder through fourth grade, primarily the students are going to be instructed in Spanish. So they'll have some of their specials classes like art, music, gym, culture. Um, some of those will be in English. Once we get to third and fourth grade, they'll also see more English integrated into their day just to help them with the transfer into the older grades and for the elements of the English language that don't necessarily appear in the Spanish language. Once they get to the five, six building, they will have an English block but they'll still have a Spanish block and some other subject areas in Spanish. And then once we get to middle school and high school, they'll really just have a couple of hours a day that are in Spanish, but they've built such a strong foundation here at Ada Vista that they don't need any more Spanish than a couple of hours. Then once they hit the real world, so to speak, um, many of our students end up going into Spanish speaking professions, are able to get a jump start, start on Spanish credits um, through the AP courses that they've taken. And we have a lot of really amazing stories that have already come out and will continue to come out about our alumni. A lot of times that parents can get a little nervous about Spanish immersion or immersion in general because their student is entering into an educational experience that they really can't comprehend. And that is scary. Your student's going to come home with materials in Spanish in a language you don't speak or in Mandarin, and you're not going to know how to help them. And one of the things that I always, always, always say to parents is the best thing that you can do is just read with your child, interact with your child. Um, enjoy it when they come home. Our job is the Spanish. Your job is to encourage a love of learning. The fact that we have a full one-way immersion program is pretty incredible because the amount of Spanish that our students are able to retain is much higher than kind of a dual language 50-50 curriculum where they spend half the day in one language and half the day in another. Full immersion, when you have such a strong second language, also strengthens your first language. And you can even see that in the test scores for our students. Once our kiddos get to the high school level, you'll see that their scores start to surpass those of their peers. Because they have such a strong second language, it only enhances their first language. Um, it's just building a lot of mental roads that you don't have if you don't go through an immersion program, especially one with the consistency that we have here at Forest Hills. So I know there are some families out there that are actually native Spanish speakers. They speak Spanish at the home. One or both parents are Spanish speakers. My family is like that, actually. My husband is from South America. I'm from here, but I lived abroad for a while. Spanish is the primary language in our home. Does Spanish immersion make sense? And my response is always, yes, it does. We may speak oral Spanish at home. We may read to each other at home, but that's not the same as academic Spanish, which is something that people and employers are looking for in the in the workforce we need academic Spanish speakers not just oral Spanish so even if you're a native speaking family our program can still be really powerful for your students to again build those language skills and then have a solid foundation to transfer to English once they begin to do so one of the other great things about this program is the experiences that our students and families can have together to um, understand and enrich themselves and be more empathetic to the world around them. So we have wonderful um, outings to uh, festivals all over Grand Rapids that may happen. Um, so I know there's the Hispanic Heritage Festival that we take our students to. In the spring, we have a Fiesta Latina where we have different booths uh, from all over the world, actually, of Spanish speaking countries and students can go and experience food and activities from those countries. We have food trucks here uh, from um, sponsored by different countries as well. Uh, we have dancers come in um, with partnerships that we have with some of the organizations around the city. And really, it's just a spectacular experience. And we look for as many community engagement possibilities um, as we can, just because part of our culture here is that uh, we are a family. Somos una familia. Una cosa que yo quiero compartir con ellos es que realmente Eda Vista es un colegio, es una escuela espectacular. No van a encontrar una familia uh, en ningún otro lugar. Y nuestros estudiantes uh, es, son nuestra familia realmente. Somos una familia y nuestra meta es crear estudiantes que van a brillar en el mundo.